Hey, you guys. Oh my god, my mouth is numb. Anywho, um, what's today? Today is Monday, the 30th, I think. Um, I'm having my phone, I'm trying to find somewhere to sit it. Cool. Um, I have my vlogging on my phone because I forgot my camera at home because I've been out since, um, like. I've been up since 6.30, but I've been out since like 7 something, um, taking my son to school, stuff like that. I had to go to the bank. I was there as soon as they opened. Um, I have to do a lot of like paperwork and stuff for something that I'm doing that I can't talk about. Not that I can't talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I'm a firm believer in not talking about things until they're done because, you know, so many people be having like hidden agendas you know pretending to be friends pretending to be interested in certain things that you have going on let me turn this air on it's hot it is already 82 degrees and it is 11 30. um yeah you know people pretending to be interested in things that you have going on and pretending to be you know rooting for you giving very much tire bangs we were all rooting for you and really the bitch is just trying to be funny and you know they're not really here for what they saying they're here for okay Ooh, I can't go all of this double chin that i got um but yeah so you know like people be trying to pretend like they're there to support you and they be excited about your endeavors and thing that you have going on but really the bitches is really just a hater behind closed curtains honey they really just in the back honey just uh, making signs and outside boycotting your shit the whole time while pretending to be cool and rooting for you so no i ain't about to be talking about what i'm doing just know shit is happening okay but well, that's what i'm doing i'm on my way now um to the office or whatever um i have a meeting today with my staff uh to get us ready for the week the following week all the things that are coming up so i'm on my way there now and um, I guess I will pick you guys when I get back to the office so you guys can see me work for a second. I always say I'm going to do it, but honestly, I forget because I don't know if people want to see it because it's really boring. I'm literally sitting there at the computer and when I watch other people's vlogs and they're like, oh, watch me work. And then it's like this fucking music in the background and it's them like looking at shit or typing on the computer. It's like, sis, I don't want to see that. So honestly, that's why I never upload it but i mean like record it but i'll just record me like in there or whatever just so y'all can see the office and stuff like that but as far as me um recording me sitting at the computer like oh shit um i don't think i'm gonna do that okay so i'm at the office this is the office tv sticky pad thing table this computer right now my looks so swollen. Oh, look. And look at that mark that that bump left. Oh, works so hard. And then sit here and just hate on your girl. Look. Literally. Um, I didn't even give you an outfit of the day. I'm wearing a two piece sweater, little um, outfit from. H&M cute it's bell bottoms white leg or whatever I have my Dior scarf and I had on my Dior oblique navy blue glasses bag my bathing a little um bag what would you call this like a uh, all, like any of these oversized side bags I call like a hobo bag because it's, it's like a big bag, whatever. So I'm here. I'm about to do some work or whatever. Get these people their coins. Process payroll. Um, and yeah. Okay, y'all. I'm back in the car. I'm leaving the office. It is 1.37. I'm about to go pick my son up from school. Cause by the time I get over there, 
um, he is gonna be out of school so that's why I'm leaving you oh these parking spaces make very tight um yeah so I'm gonna have to go pick him up I need to figure out what I'm cooking for dinner I know that's first thing gonna ask me when he get home. What's for dinner? So I need to figure out what I'm cooking real quick. And baby, this oh, y'all can't see me. I got the stairwell. Um, and that's pretty much it, honey. Like. Hey y'all, uh, it's dark. I'm in my room. I am back home. Um, picked my son up from school. Um, I've been here like some hours. And yeah, so I'm just gonna end the vlog here for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday the 30 is it the 31st? Or no, 31st. Mommy, I see. Wanna say hi? Say hi. Oh, you wanna show your outfit? Oh, you look so cute. Um, it's the 31st. Um, it's like 10 something in the morning. Me and London have been up since seven. Dropped my son off at school, breakfast, cleaning. Now we're both dressed and I'm about to go to the mall real quick to do some exchanges. Leave that alone. To do some exchanges. Let me show you guys what I'm wearing really quick. I'm wearing this black two-piece like silky outfit that I did at H&M Hall a while ago with my pine green um, Jordan ones, a little Chanel scarf. I got my hair conditioning under here and I'm wearing this green bag that goes perfectly with it. Like what? This bag is so cute. I got it from Zara. So, yes, yeah, so I'm about to go do that. I'm about to get in the car. I'll see y'all when I get to the mall. Hey, we are at the mall. This hair is so crunchy. Like, look at this hair. Please. I'm outside in a AMG. Right outside. TT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Still with the dolls that I grew beside. All the niggas brown. I ain't in it, guys. Look at how cute this lime green is. The orange. They have all the cute. I don't know if y'all can hear me. So much music in here. Gotta watch the time because it's flying right by. I'm outside in an AMG. Right outside. TT. Two turn, baby girl. You know me. Okay, so I'm in Zara right now. Look at how cute. I'm in the kids section. Look how cute this outfit is. How cute is this? The top is 27. These are the pants. Pants are 27. So freaking cute. And look at this. It's like this banana yellow cashmere two piece short set. How freaking cute is that? I can't wait until London gets this big. They have it in gray. So cute. With the shorts. And then look at this one. The sweater. With the leggings. That goes in the foot. Look, come on, Zara. Kids, and give the girls a run. So cute. Oh my god, look at these overalls. Oh, it's a dress. A cashmere dress. So freaking cute. I love it. I always look over here even though London can't fit this size yet. Oh my god, this is so cute with this. I have it in black. So bomb. And then this. Oh my god.
Okay, I'm back in the back in the car. Um, oh my god, I found the cutest mommy and me. First of all, I'm trying to sit this right here. I found the cutest mommy and me little um matching jackets. Oh my god, it's so cute. First of all, I never even seen nothing like that in Zara. Um, where you can like they have it to match like the kids or whatever. So I got that. So I'll show y'all that when I get home. But I also found Ebony Wood because if you're on YouTube, you know Kyra was telling the girls to go out and get this because it smells so good. Um, and this is by Joe Malone. Like, I've been seeing this Joe Malone collection by them, but all of the ones that I had smelled, I did not like it. So I wasn't really pressed. And then she was like, oh, that Ebony Wood smells so good, blah, blah, blah. So I'm about to try it. One camera and the guy was like, oh, if you open it, you know, you can't return it. I'm like, sir, that, that's fine. This is what the inside looks like. The bottle is actually big and it is a perfume. So this is what the bottle looks like. It's cute. It looks fancy or whatever. So let's spray. Oh, I already have one perfume, but. Okay, so it does smell good. It definitely does smell woody. Like, you definitely can smell the wood scent. Um, but, like, honestly, all Joe Malone stuff is, like, really, um, like, strong, intense. In my opinion, like, more masculine smells. Um, I would just have to spray it on when I don't have anything else on and then see how it wears. Take my daughter, get a quick little snack. She's hungry. It's lunch. What time is it? It's 12 11, so it's lunchtime right now. So we're about to go stop, um, get some food. Son gets all that one. So by the time we do that and all of that, it'll be time for him to get out of school. So, um, yeah, I'm about to go do that. So I guess I'll pick you back up when I pick him up. <laughs> Why I'm so mad? I go to Taco Bell thinking I'm about to get my usual little combo. Girl, why they do not got nacho fries no more? And the lady's talking about they seasonal. Like, what? So mad. Focus. Uh, let's focus on the stairwell. well. Because I have you like in this little. Anyway. So it is 4.55, I am just not leaving the office. And now I'm about to go to the grocery store to get some stuff that I need to cook today. And then I'm gonna be going home. So um, once I get home, I'll show you out the jackets or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'll see y'all in a second. I'll just, oh my God, yeah, I'm so hot and tired. I just got home. I think it's like almost seven o'clock. I've been out all day. I'm ready. Okay, bye. See you later. Right. So this is the jacket I got for London. How cute is that? It's like a black bomber coat. This was twenty-seven ninety. And then I go downstairs in the women's department and then look what I find. Oh my God. How freaking cute is that? So we can match. Oh my God. This was $69.90. Was it overpriced? Definitely. They talking about some water repellent. Girl. Oh, and then in here has a hood. But honestly, I don't think it's, it was worth no $69. Let's see what this hood is looking like. Then it's this thin little hood. Sweetie. Definitely wasn't worth $69. But I, the little, the fact that it had matched hers, it was just too cute. 
not to get like look it's the exact pattern oh that's gonna be so cute but anywho that is that honey i am exhausted like i said i'm about to cook dinner really quickly i'm about to get in the shower finish editing my blog because i didn't get to finish editing it last night so i'm gonna do that and then honey i'm going to bed so i will see you guys tomorrow hi guys good morning it is 10 10 on the dot today is thursday september 2nd um i've been up since 6 30 obviously school's back in session i take my son to school blah 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 all of this and that so i'm on my way to starbucks right now because i didn't cook breakfast because i needed to get out early um, as y'all can see, it's like gloomy outside. I have on a sweatsuit. <laughs> y'all know I love sweatsuit weather, honey. I've been wearing sweatsuits, honestly. Shit, in the summertime, too. Just the, um, I've been wearing the wide leg, like, bell-bottom style ones with, like, cute little crop tops. Anyway, um, I'm about to go to Starbucks. I'm about to go after that. Then I'm going to go to the post office. I have to mail some stuff off. Then after that, I'm going to go to Sam's Club. And then after that, I'm going to go to Walmart. Then after that, I'm going to go to the office. And then after that, um, I'm going to be uh, going to pick my son up from school. And then after that, uh, I think I'm going to go. I think I'm going to just go home, honestly. Like, it's really nothing outside. Like, there's nothing outside. There's nothing to do. Like, literally. So I'm probably just going to go home. Um, finish watching Manifest. And yeah. Okay, y'all. So I'm at the um, post office. But yeah, so anyway, I'm here. I'm about to go in here and get these stamps real quick so I can mail this shit off. Sorry, mail this stuff off. My daughter's in the back. Mail these things off um, and then hit it on to the rest of my errands or whatever. Get, get your boot. Get your vitamins, y'all. Drink your shots. Okay, y'all. <clears throat> I'm at Sam's Club. I'm in the car. Eating my food. Mommy. Mm hmm. Oh, my. Because there's no more. You ate it all. Mommy. Mm -hmm. Mommy. I think. You want burger? There's no more burger. <laughs> Mommy, God, no burger. <laughs> Um, yeah, so we're in the car. We're about to get out. Go in here right quick. It's crowded, too. Yeah. Um, go in here real quick, get that stuff. Come out and hit it to the next spot or whatever. Y'all, I don't know who needs to hear this, but outside is so fucked up. Like, if y'all pay attention to y'all government, stuff that's going on. Baby, things that these people are talking about in these press conferences. Please take a second. Hop off this video. Go and look at things that are going on. Go look at the real news, not the fake news. I always say <clears throat> the United States news is really Mommy, fake. Like it's very. Okay. It's very watered down and it's not Mommy. real. Go watch. Mommy the news channels out of the country that's where you're gonna get the real tea and see what's really going on so i'm gonna say that and i'm gonna leave this right here and i'm also going to say i'm doing my part or at least i feel like i'm doing my part by sharing this information that i'm sharing because some people are woke and some people are not and when i say woke that means spiritually that also means woke to things that are happening around them and being aware about things that are happening around them in this world that we are living in right now so please go if you especially if you have children please go to the store get you some water get you some food get you some candles get you some flashlights get you if you have a fireplace get you some wood get you go and get you some supplies and i want y'all to pay attention to y'all grocery stores where y'all live and comment down below if y'all notice in y'all grocery stores that y'all grocery stores have been empty and when i say empty i mean that shelves are bare some stuff is there some stuff is not but it's really bare compared to what 
um, what the chefs look like before. And then also too, all of the people that drive trucks that deliver the food, they are on strike right now. I don't know if people even knew that. These people are on strike. They are not even driving their trucks delivering food. They're on strike because they're they're trying to mandate them to get the vaccine and they're not going for it. And also people that have crops, the government mommy, is coming to mommy. them. Yes. I think. Okay. The government is coming to their property mommy. and paying them money mommy. to basically mommy. kill their crops. So I'm going to just leave that right there. Y'all can go do your own research and look it up and do whatever y'all want to do with the information but i'm just doing my part and sending it out there and that's that so yeah i'm about to go in sam's club and i'll pick y'all back up when i come out okay yes yeah, so i'm in sam's club let me show y'all what i was talking about now sam's club has this up one limit so limit one so that means you can only get one tissue one tissue per family so <laughs> baby and this is on essential items same thing with these toilet paper look at this all paper towels and bath tissue limit one look at that now mind y'all i kept coming to sam's club last week back to back to back I came to sam's club last week like three times literally none of these signs were up now all of a sudden these signs are up yeah i better wake y'all fucking game up baby okay y'all i am in the car now i just left um sam's club i was about to go to walmart right now but i'm not gonna go because it's already 12 o'clock well 11 51 and i still need to get to the office um because i gotta do like two things and i gotta let somebody in there then i gotta come back down here to um like back down this way to get my son from school like sweetie at this point <laughs> can i get a nanny because this is getting getting real you know it's getting real intense with these errands and things let's go do that now do y'all see what I was talking about? Sweetie, these people is not out here playing with us and I'm not, not out here playing with them. Baby, y'all wanna sit here and do these limits on this tissue and this water and shit, that's fine. I got a car, I will drive to the store every day or I will go in the store, get in the line, go put my shit in my car, go back in and get in line again. Cause that's the type of time that I'm up. Y'all know about to sit right here and play in my face. Now, when I got kids, I never talk about anything political on this page. It's, you know, normally like fun blogs and stuff like that. But like I said earlier, I feel like it's my job to tell people what I know so that way they can be alert and aware and start paying attention to certain things that they were not paying attention to before. Anyway, I'm about to keep going on and on. I'm about to continue to do what I got to do at this place. And I'm going to just pick y'all back up when I get to Walmart. Anywho, um, it is 3.22. I'm just now checking in. Today is Friday. Oh, my God. All the, uh, the kids in the back or whatever. Um, I'm about to go to my mom's house so I can get my hair done. It's still wet. I have washed it. Um... Yeah, anywho, so I'm in the car. It is 81 degrees, literally, like, L.A. is hot, baby. So, yeah, I'm in the car. It's hot. I'm about to go over there. So, I'll pick y'all up um, when I get up there. Hey, guys. Mm -mm. Light. Here I come. Um, okay, y'all, so today is... Saturday it's like 11 o'clock um I did not vlog yesterday because as y'all can see my hair is still not done I was upset I ended up going to my mom's house just chilling over there I did not get home until like one in the morning so now I'm up um I'm about to get dressed I'm still supposed to be getting my hair done just later on here I come London um so yeah I'm about to get dressed and then I'm about to go to the nail shop so well, um I'll pick you guys up when I get to the nail shop Okay, you guys, I am finally dressed. Hopefully, y'all can see me. I have on this red top from Zara, gray skirt from Zara. 
red and gray dunks, my gray Telfar bag, my little regular bracelets, my nameplate necklace, my name earrings, and then my Bass Shop um, Pro gray hat. So this is what I'm wearing. Um, I'm about to go to the nail shop. So I'll see y'all when I get there. <laughs> I just <laughs> left the nail shop. Well, I'm in the car. Um, and I'm about to see if I get my hair done, baby, because I got this hat. My hair went was yesterday, as y'all know. I cannot make it. Baby, there's so many things going on. I got rescheduled for today. Trying to see if I can get it done. You know, people just don't want to do your hair. I don't know. So, I'm in the car right now. Um, so, I'm going to see what's going on with that. If I can't get my hair done, then I'm probably going to go to Zora. Because <laughs> this man <laughs> wants to get some things. You know, say hey to the vlog. <laughs> yeah, he feels so Hey, y'all. <laughs> he feels so sorry to talk about my post I put on Instagram. Baby, I don't feel no type of way. No, too. not a way, but he is funny. No, but she's fucking childish. I'm going to show y'all okay? real quick. Can y'all see? I don't know if y'all can see, but it's a... If your boyfriend went to ATL this weekend, he went to Pride. He ain't with the homies, he with the girls, sis. <laughs> I'm just trying to let people know what's going on. Because, you know, people, they be confused. They don't know. Like, if your boyfriend just randomly up and said he going to ATL this weekend. <laughs> maybe. Uh, <laughs> uh, you know what I thought about. <laughs> then that's where, hey, that's what's going on in ATL. My nigga, he ain't in Atlanta this weekend. Yeah, <laughs> my my nigga not so <laughs> none, of, none of the homies none of the bros i know mm -mm. they ain't you know they other places they at home you know so that's what's going on in atlanta right now people in atlanta ain't even in atlanta that lit there they went somewhere else because they know what's going on yeah, this weekend you know so true. i'm just saying maybe you didn't know so just tell a friend to tell a friend next year around this time <laughs> the same things happen that you know where they're going <laughs> You know, I'm just saying. Wait, when is DC Pride? <laughs> I'm about to get your all the Pride dates. Yo, so y'all can just know. I did. Uh, when is DC Pride? Pretty. I don't know. He know. I'm going to find out. I'm going to let y'all know. DC Pride is Memorial Weekend. Oh, so hey, that's... Oh, so we that so would already pass. Labor Day weekend. So this Labor Day... Oh, so Memorial Labor Day pass, yeah. weekend, Pride, ATL, mm -hmm. Memorial, DC Pride. Okay, now y'all know. Now y'all got the 411 on the Pride Info. Okay, baby? So, if y'all man randomly saying he going to them two places on those particular dates and you're not invited, you know what's going on. Y'all. <laughs> Where's the hooker? Give me some hooker. I'm just saying. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I mean, I could do your hair. You really would not let me do your hair like that's so crazy. You're not about to play play with fire in my head. See, I'm not play girl, you get in braids. I'm not about to play with no fire. Sir, you do not know I do no fucking knowledge. Yes, I braids. do. You know I do knowledge braids. Yes, I do. You know how to add the hair in. I sure do. We gonna see. I know how to when fit I get, it in the hair. Because I'm about to go to my appointment. I'm gonna let him do one braid, y'all, and I'm putting on camera. I'm gonna let y'all see <laughs> if he can do this fucking Watch. braid or not. Okay, um. We went to the nail shop, went to go get my hair done, as y'all can see, period. Um and now we have this little place. What is it called? Hennessy and Tacos. Hennessy mm -hmm. and, and Tacos. Hennessy and Tacos in downtown LA. Um, so we just found parking. And we are about to walk up right now to go in and see what it's given. It's a lot of people here. So it should be a vibe, you know. Um, I don't know if I could bring my camera in. So I'm going to leave it in the car just in case. But I will record on my phone. So the quality is going to change. So yeah, because I don't want to have to walk back to the car. So I'll see y'all when we get inside. Oh, and he didn't do one of my braids. So. That's because she wouldn't let me because we're too busy being fucking messy on Instagram. <laughs> Get it, fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. <laughs> Get it, juvenile. Oh, not the rise. 
Oh. He'll rise. He'll rise, y'all. Period. <laughs> So she, it is. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. She, she rented out the Bel Air Boys Lounge. Yeah. Shout out to the owner of uh, Bel Air Boys for letting us rent this Here nice establishment out. out. Shout out to you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is how you do it. You rent out shit. You don't just chill with everybody. Well, this is my new friend. I'm going to be at his house on Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Hey, I'm back. Welcome back to our channel. So Cause we, guys, because we share. You know, we've been late on set. What are you about to see? So we here now. We're about to do karaoke and things, and just vibe out. It you look good. Hey, you know. Was it all focus? Ooh. Baby, yeah. okay, book me, book me, <laughs> <laughs> book me for your property band or whatever. They looking good. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday, but I'm at a little function, so I'm just out. <laughs> Let you guys tag along. They play bingo. Hi, mama. So we are. We ain't doing nothing. We're just chilling. Um, so I just let y'all watch what we doing. We <laughs> know. Okay, girl. Home, so I will see you guys um, in the next vlog. <laughs>